Andromeda is the nearest major galaxy to the Milky Way and is about 2.5 million light years away from us. Andromeda is also the most distant thing you can see with the naked eye. It is the largest galaxy in the local group in terms of span or diameter. But scientists have found out that the Andromeda galaxy is approaching the Milky Way at nearly a quarter million miles per hour. Is Andromeda on a collision course with our Milky Way? If scientists are to be believed, yes. But should we be worried about this collision? Welcome to Lab 360. It's time to explore. As recently as 2012, scientists confirmed that Andromeda is indeed on a collision course with our Milky Way. Andromeda is hurtling towards the Milky Way at a speed of 110 kilometers per second. Even at that speed, it will take 4 billion years for Andromeda to collide with our Milky Way, that is how far it is from us. And how did scientists confirm that Andromeda is going to collide with our galaxy? They used the Hubble Space Telescope to track the motions of stars in Andromeda. Unlike what you might think, such collisions of galaxies are pretty common in the universe. Such events play out over billions of years. So how do scientists predict what would happen a billion years from now? Scientists create models of the two galaxies using currently observed data, and then play out the model or simulation like a movie to see what would happen billions of years from now. The scientists' models say that the final galaxy resulting from the merger of Andromeda and Milky Way would be an elliptical galaxy without the beautiful spiral arms both the galaxies now possess. What will happen to the stars of the two galaxies in the event of such a collision? Contrary to what you might be thinking, stars in reality are so far apart that there are very less chances of any two stars colliding. What about the black holes at the centers of the two galaxies? They both are predicted to spiral into each other after millions of years. And what will happen to our solar system? According to scientists, there's a 50% probability that compared to how far our solar system is from the center of the Milky Way right now, in the new elliptical merged galaxy, it will be swept out three times farther than that from the center of the new galaxy. In fact, there's a 12% chance our solar system would be flung out of the new galaxy. And the most important question. What would happen to humans in such a scenario? Well, in about 1.5 billion years from now, the sun would have become so bright that Earth would be the victim of a runaway greenhouse effect wiping out any trace of life. So, humanity would have long been dead before this cataclysmic collision of Andromeda with our Milky Way. Though humanity won't be prevalent, Earth could still be there. And assuming that humans still continue to exist on Earth, what would they see at that time in the sky? They would see Andromeda getting larger and larger in the Earth's sky, eventually stretching from horizon to horizon. Wouldn't that be beautiful? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. And be sure to subscribe to Lab360 for the latest revelations in space exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated, and let's continue to explore together.